I, I, I learned that this particular shootout was not, as many are, uh, graded. So, you know, there wasn't a winner. There wasn't a, one with the highest score and then the next highest score and so on, right? Yeah, I mean, that's one of the things that we always try to do, which is be very fair, very objective, look at measurements uh, and and be as completely, uh, you know, transparent as we can with the results of, of, of what we saw in the shootout. You know, if you look at, at some of the groups and forums, you'll see, you know, massive hyperbole, you know, this is the best thing ever. And this is the worst thing ever. And why would anybody want this? And we, we really try to rem we really try to remove all that and, and avoid it as much as possible and be as fair as we can. And so we'll point out, you know, if if uh, if one product uh, maybe falls a little short in one area, but we'll point out it's it's, uh, you know, it's objective uh, superiority in another department, maybe. So mm -hmm. that's that's what we've always tried to do. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And if if I can just jump in real quick too, uh, sometimes when we do our speaker shootouts, we do do that scoring one to 10, because those are double blind. Mm. But in this one, people were aware what they were looking at. It's just too hard to hide all those projectors and switch sure. them. So we didn't think scoring was fair. And we also, this time we wanted to contextualize, just like Steve was talking about, maybe this projector is better for this application and this one's better for that application. And if you're just doing a strict scoring thing, um, sometimes you can lose that context. Mm. 